If you knew Frank J. Gallegos Jr., you knew someone always had your back. He was kind of like a big teddy bear, cuddly teddy bear. <laughs> Especially if you were a student at Adobe Acres Elementary School. He would say that he had two grandsons, and then he'd say, but I have 650-some grandchildren. <laughs> They'd look at him and say, what? And he'd say, well, he's the grandpa of, of the school. <laughs> his love for the children in his South Valley community earned him an endearing nickname. That's how they knew him, by Grandpa Frank. Grandpa Frank spent a lot of time here in the cafeteria. A longtime volunteer at the school, he served meals and made sure no student ever sat alone. My dad had such a big heart, loving heart, giving heart that he definitely could really relate to some of the situations that children were in. When COVID hit and the school was empty, he still worked to keep students' bellies full, delivering meals to families who couldn't get out for food. He did that for breakfast and lunch every single day. Until fall of 2020, when Frank got sick and ended up in the hospital, he fought for seven weeks. His family prayed constantly from a distance. We had to watch him pass away um, on an iPad. It was difficult, still is. The loss of Frank felt not only throughout the school, but the South Valley, because his love for others reached far beyond Adobe Acres. That's why Leonette Snow, a kindergarten teacher at the school, submitted a proposal to Bernalillo County Commissioners on behalf of Adobe Acres Neighborhood Association. They wanted the South Valley Aquatic Center to have a new name, the Frank J. Gallegos Jr. South Valley Aquatic Center. It'll be a constant reminder of him and his family and what they've done for our community and our neighborhood. And, um, you know, hopefully it'll be a way for people to remember him. After all, he was the driving force that transformed the pool into what it is today. Three, two, one. Yeah! When the ribbon was officially cut in 2019, Frank was front and center, grateful and determined. I used to be a lifeguard here years ago, and then we never had nothing like this, but I love it, my kids love it, the community loves it. Again, uh, thanks to everybody that was involved in this project, and we'll see more to come. We have more to do uh, for our community here. And again, thank you very much. His legacy at the pool lives on today. Commissioners approved the name change, a tribute to Frank's selflessness and drive to make his community better. You're having fun and cooling off on a hot day. You know, we have to thank Frank. We thank Frank for that. I believe the South Valley is the heart and soul of Bernalillo County. Uh, but this community is what uh, is what it is because of the people like Frank who get involved in their community, who love to have a mission to better their community, uh, no matter what it takes. Frank um, never got one single vote, if you will, but he did more than most people do by 10 a.m. every single day. Memories of Grandpa Frank etched into the hearts of all who come here to cool off. I think he would be very honored, very, very honored. His life a testament to the power of one man to make a difference in the lives of many.